While getting to Turnitin.com for the first time is quite simple. All you need is the ID number from your teacher along with the password. Once you get to the site, you're going to click on Create Account. Then you're going to scroll down to Create a New Account and select Student. The class ID number, which was given to you by your teacher, will be entered first. Then you have to enter the class password. Next, you're going to e enter your name first and then last. And then you can select how it is presented. We ask that you enter your school email address. That way, if you forget what the email address and password you used, we can remind you, especially since this Turnitin account is going to go with you from year to year. Then you're going to enter a password. For the password, we ask that you use your ID number followed by the first letter of your last name. Now this program is case sensitive for the password, so I suggest that you do lowercase with the first letter of your last name. That way you don't have to worry about hitting shift or anything like that. The secret question is so that if you forget your password, the program will ask you the secret question, you give the answer, and if you answer correctly, they know you are who you say you are. I like to choose father's middle name because my dad's middle name never changes. Unfortunately, my favorite song and movie do change frequently. So I will enter that in. Last thing you have to do is just agree to all of the agreements, um, the policy of the program, and click on I agree. Voila! Now I am in Turnitin.com and I have access to my English 1 Honors Period 4 class.